Finding a quarter of quantities. To find a quarter of a set of objects, we have to divide the set into four equal groups. We can do this in two ways, by sharing and grouping. Let's look at sharing first. We have four circles. We want to find out how many circles would be a quarter of four. We move the circles one at a time into the boxes to share them equally between the four boxes like this. Now we count how many are in one box. We have one in the blue box, so a quarter of four is one. Now let's find a quarter of four by grouping. Again, we have four circles and we want to find a quarter. We move the circles into groups of four like this. Now we count how many groups of four we have. We have one, so a quarter of four is one. Both methods give us the same answer. Sharing might be a bit easier, but grouping is better practice for using the times tables later on. Let's look at some more examples. Dan has eight frogs. A quarter of them catch flies. How many frogs catch flies? We can find a quarter of eight by sharing between four, like this. So each person gets the same number of frogs. Now we count how many frogs one person has. Dan has two frogs, so a quarter of eight is two. Or we can find a quarter of eight by grouping in fours, like this. One group of four. Two groups of four, so a quarter of eight is two. A quarter of these 12 pigs want to fly. How many pigs does Tim need to buy wings for? We can find a quarter of 12 by sharing between four, like this. So each person gets the same number of pigs. Now we count how many pigs one person has. Tim has three pigs. So a quarter of 12 is three. Or we can find a quarter of 12 by grouping in fours like this. One group of four. Two groups of four. Three groups of four. So a quarter of 12 is three. If I give a quarter of these strawberries to each child, how many will they each have? We can find a quarter of 16 by sharing between four, like this. So each person gets the same number of strawberries. And now we count how many strawberries one person has. Meg has four strawberries, so a quarter of 16 is four. Or we can find a quarter of 16 by grouping in fours like this. One group of four. Two groups of four. Three groups of four. Four groups of four, so a quarter of 16 is four. And finally, what is a quarter of these shells? We can find a quarter of 20 by sharing between four like this. So each person gets the same number of shells. And now we count how many shells one person has. Jess has five shells, so a quarter of 20 is five. Or we can find a quarter of 20 
by grouping in fours like this. One group of four, two groups of four, three groups of four, four groups of four, five groups of four. So a quarter of 20 is five. Thank you for watching. Like and subscribe for more.